hello everyone in this video i am going to show you that how you can download and install these lower words and add it in your video just by dragging it and dropping it in premiere pro i'm going to help you with the steps to download it steps to import it and then steps to edit it and then finally export it in your video so let's get started So the very first thing you need to do is you need to go to this particular website named as mrhorse.com and you need to download this free plugin. This is called as Premiere Composer. You can just download it by clicking on the download option for free and once you have downloaded and installed it in Premiere Pro, you will be able to see it in the, the Windows extension and Premiere Composer. So this is the basically a uh, video that i am going to edit now this is what you must be seeing in your system so let's try to do it this way so very thing first thing that we have is we have the file here so if i want to use that particular lower third i mean to say this one then how to do it is the file that you have downloaded you will have to install under the premiere composer you can just go to your Premiere Composer. Once you go there, you can just see the started page. Most probably, you will already be seeing many pre transitions, icons, and even lower thirds for your video. This is already free here, but if you want to add something extra, the way we are doing, you can just go to User Library and you will find an option of Add Folder. Here it says you can add your own MOGRTs or audio files or videos using this folder. So if you click on add folder and then just select the file that you have by clicking it something like this, the lower third, just select that particular folder and then what will happen is you will be able to see that particular folder under this plugin without the MOGRT files which you can add and then edit it. For example, I am going to add this one. I am just dragging, dragging it here. Once I have added it, you have to just go to that particular part to edit it. You can see that this particular text is here. If I just hide my video, you will be able to see it as well. Let's make changes with the color. You can just set any color that you would like to add for yourself. If you want to make changes with the names then you can just add it here for example i am adding a random word like subscribe now after that you can make changes with the font as well example i am using this one here and this one here All right now if you want to make changes with any other attributes you can make the changes as per available options here if you are not happy with these options then you can just select it and go to effect control and make changes from here as well for example position you can just drag it down and maybe you can bring it here and maybe if you want to make it visible you can just go back to your premiere pro and then just click on this option you will get the option of editing it you can make changes with the font and then the color as well let's try to do another one you can go to the same option again and let's try to bring it this one i have just drag and dropped it in this uh, timeline i will go here and then i have to just make changes here so what i will need to do is just keep select that particular form or the lower text and then you will be able to make changes here you can make changes with the color as well and the option of scale and width is also available in this particular 
project. If you again want to make changes, you can keep it selected, go to effect control and make changes as per your convenience. So in this way, you saw the option to download it, install it and edit it. Now how to export it, you just need to go to the file and then export that particular media. I have already edited this video by using this text and even other stuffs. Let me show you how it looks. So this is one of the projects that I have been working as a freelancer for one of my clients and if you see here you will see many text and many icons that I am using. Apart from just adding the subtitle I have many other things that I have been using like icons, text, emojis and many other options. If you would like me to offer other options as well you can just let me know in the comment and then subscribe to this channel so that you will be, be easily notified whenever i will help you to get other stuffs like for example we have logo option we have title options scenes slides even word slides as well i hope this video was helpful to you if you like this video Make a comment, add a like and also share with someone who will need it. And if you would like to know more about freelancing and Premiere Pro and After Effects, you can subscribe to this channel and check out other videos. Thank you for watching.